it's straightforward, mm-hmm. but that's okay. Because yeah. sometimes you just want to sit down and just watch a movie that's not too complicated, that you don't have to fucking sit Most there. Most of my favorite and, movies. And, like, pay attention to every well, inch of dialogue. I gotta like, tell you, more often than not, while we do this show, it's gonna be those over anything else. Because, you know... We're here for the yucks. We don't have to... We're not going to sit there and go like, okay, now here's where we're going to get into the human condition. We'll, yeah. We will do those every now and then. But generally, yeah, we're just going to cover fun shit because that's kind of what we where we live. Uh, it, And if it's not being uh, obvious, I mean, Delbert is the MVP. Yeah, John Goodman is the fucking man. But like I said even last week, of like pretty much every movie where John Goodman's in, he's probably going to be the MVP. Cause Although... Uh... John Goodman's a goddamn national treasure. Low key, mm. the Margaret is a really good character. She too. is, but you if, know, she's a if, spitfire. Yeah, and all that. Mm. she would she would have won if John Goodman wasn't in this yeah. movie. Like plain and simple. So yes, like I said at the beginning of the show, I mm-hmm. guess we have we're promising a more horrific yes. October next, next year. Next year, I will horror the fuck out of it because it was a little bit family friendly this year mm-hmm. for the most part. I mean, I guess the stuff's not family friendly, but well. Kind of. Sleepaway Camp, not so much. No. Um, that might be the only real horror film we did, aside from, like, Texas Chainsaw Massacre doesn't count, but, like, as far as the fun ones, yeah. I think Sleepaway Camp is the only one where you can be like, yeah, it's a little fucked up. But so, everything else was just kind of fun. So for the month of November, there'll be mm-hmm. no theme. No. It'll just be a grab bag. Yep. We're just going to pick, we just picked some random movies. We literally did. It's kind of funny. Mainly mm-hmm. because of Steve's schedule. So. Yeah, I got to, I got to get, I got to knock this shit out and I needed stuff that was somewhat easy to get to. And so there'll be no super complicated movies. No. Here, just some straightforward, some mostly comedies, I guess. I don't know. Pretty much. Um, although oddly enough, next week's movie, uh, I, I thought I had the notes done and then I remembered, and this is a little inside baseball. I remembered an episode of Smodcast. Oh, okay. Uh, so I had to go find that episode. And, so you're uh, adding. Yep. So I'm going to be adding some more. So the notes might be a little longer than I expected. So for next week, to kick off November, we were going way back to December 13th, 1985. So for the, I guess, cult classic? Definitely cult classic. Uh, Clue. Yes. Um, A movie... Uh, near and dear to my heart, oh, at least. Oh, God, yes. <laughs> oh, absolutely. I uh, love this movie. It'll be, that. it'll, uh, oh, another spoiler warning. This is going to be another one of our gush episodes. Oh, this will be, like... this will be an unbelievable love fest. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. So again, mm-hmm. look out for that next week. Mm-hmm. But for this week, you were Steve. You were Justin. And we're way back and gone. Can I rip down this floor? <laughs>